Welcome to Amy Learns to Cook. On the show today, we're going to put my new Cuisinart 12 cup food processor to the test. Now, if you would like any information about this food processor, please watch my video of when I'm unboxing the 12 cup food processor. But now that it's all unboxed and set up, we're going to put it to the test. We are going to chop some cilantro, we're going to slice some onions, and we're going to grate some cheese, and we're going to see if the Cuisinart lives up to its reputation. So join me as we put the Cuisinart 12 cup food processor to the test. Okay, the very first thing we're going to do is cut up some cilantro. And one great thing about this food processor is, is that it has a mini bowl. And this mini bowl is great for small jobs. So you basically just put the mini bowl in here. Okay, so once you have the mini bowl in here, you're just going to put the small blade, you're going to put the um, little stick in the blade and you're going to stick the blade inside here and it's going to um, sort of lock down. So what we're going to do is we're going to chop our cilantro. So we got two really nice bunches of cilantro and cilantro is great. Cilantro is one of these things that just make Mexican food Mexican food, right? Some people don't like cilantro. They think it smells like soap. I happen to love it. So we're just going to trim our cilantro just like this to get the big, get the leaves off. We're going to take off the really big stalks. A little bit is okay, but a lot is not okay. Our cilantro inside the cup here. And I think we're going to be able to get both of these bunches in here. It smells so good. Pretty much just shave it off to keep the stems out of it. And that looks pretty good. So we're going to put this in here. Get all our cilantro in here. So now we're going to put our food processor to its first test, right? So let's put the lid on. We need to make sure it's on there. And then we're just going to pulse. Until our cilantro is chopped just like we want it. You don't want to do it on the way on on because you're going to make cilantro soup, right? You just want to gently pulse it until you get it the consistency you want. And I might do this just a little hair more. And we should be good to go. So let's look at the consistency. Okay, we're going to take the bowl out. And one great thing about the Cuisinart is the blade should stay in here. And we're just going to put our cilantro into our prep bowl. So, cilantro is chopped. Looks pretty nice. And for the small bowl, it's a little awkward with this in there but I would give it a thumbs up. Okay, so we're going to put the slicing blade to the test again. We're just going to slice up some onions. Tomorrow we're getting ready to make some fajitas. And so we're going to slice up the onions for our fajitas. So I cut the onions in half moons and we're going to slice them. So we're going to put them in this way so we get half moon slices and we're going to let her rip. A 
Okay, so let's see how the onion looks. Take off the blade here. And we have perfect onion slices for our fajitas. We're going to be making a marinade, and we're going to marinate these onions in our special fajita marinade. Okay, so we've pretty much abandoned our test here and there was a specific reason why we did this. We've been cleaning it in between each one of these and we've noticed something very significant. In the lid there is this seal, seal that seals the bowl lid to the bowl. The problem is food gets stuck in here and it gets up into the lid and it's pretty impossible to get out. There's lettuce stuck in here and cilantro. And the problem is if it can't be adequately cleaned, there's a risk that this will, it's just contaminated. And that, especially for a germaphobe, is not acceptable. So even though it performed fairly well on several of the tasks, um, the fact that this lid cannot be adequately cleaned and food gets stuck, there's holes here, but it, it just doesn't come out. That means that this food processor is a complete and total fail. So, thumbs down to Cuisinart, and we're going to go back to the drawing board. We're going to try the 11 cup. Um, actually Cuisinart, but it doesn't have any of these fancy things. It's a regular um, food processor. So stay tuned. We're going to order that and this one's going back and we're going to order that and we will have an unboxing as soon as it arrives. If you like this video, please subscribe below because there's more videos on the way. And go ahead and visit my website at amylearnstocook.com. We are also on Twitter and Pinterest at amylearnstocook.